yeah back out again this time we've come to the village of Scotland tiny village good walk oh, it's so steep it's so steep and we'll come from down there it's so steep but Brucey bonus no wind yes ideal it's a little bit overcast at the moment but it's due to clear up there's a blue sky trying to peek through so this should be a good one I'll just get my breath back and then we'll head up again up there up there that looks like a path of doom and then over onto the lock of terror and we'll see how we get on but for now that's the grey mare's tail nice isn't it I'm gonna try and go there tomorrow along the path there just have a look at the viewpoint get a better picture so this is the grey mare's tail I was pointing out before it's the viewpoint we've come all the way up here what a struggle so hot I mean what a contrast in weather Whoo! nice eh we've just got like a little bit round there gets into a bit of a flatter area we've done all the hard work like coming up there so we'll just continue along this path here we should get up there yeah, we've come across these wheeled goats Sorry, I've just, just got a message let's just get through my bike sold oh has it yeah yeah look yeah wild goats there you go Damien the fell wonder was looking for wild goats in the Cheviots. They're here, they're on the holidays. <laughs> They've gone off on holiday, they come here. <laughs> hey, how do they stick on the side of there? There's loads down there. Ah, there's millions of them. They're all hidden away, aren't they? This one here, how's he there? That's a, just a sheer drop. <laughs> God. You'll see these on the big screen. All right, so there you go, Damien. That's where your goats are. They're here. On the end of it. It might. Chilling out. Uh, it might be. In the summer, there was people swimming down there. That one next one down in the in the pools. Right, we just got to go around here, up over the over the moorland and then <laughs> when we get to the lock we're gonna have a walk around the lock and find the non-boggy zone and hopefully there won't be anybody there I think there's plenty of pitches if there is somewhere there we'll find somewhere look forward to it look forward to getting this backpack off Lock skein or lock skein because I'm not Scottish, I don't have to say lock probably. Get that beautiful, beautiful. We still got walk right up the far end though. We'll get a pitch up there, but for now, what do you think? Mm -hmm. Stunners, mm -hmm. nice, like. Gorgeous, isn't it? So tempting to get in. She brought her towels. Oh, not again. Oh, no. Oh, you can't walk over that. Um, okay. Look, come, go? come down here. Look, this, this looks like it's so boggy, the path. 
we're trying to get to the far end. She's just gone for it. Are you in a world of hurt? How nice is it here? I think if you come here I'd recommend gators because it's a bit wet underfoot. aiming for over there Ooh. oh oh yeah it's half path half path of death walked from the far end of this lock all the way along there boggy there is a little path you can make it out um, just walk a bit through the heather come here and down onto this beach look at this what a beautiful place we've just got to find a pitch now but it looks plenty flat over there we've seen a video by um, stripey hat guy hello stripey well done for showing us the spot. He pitched over here somewhere. It looked nice, it looked ideal. Look at this. Oh, we should have brought with big towels. Could have got in. Let me get the feet in. But yeah, what a place. Drone would have been perfect here. That's what I need to get, a drone. Hard one, didn't I? But it was crap. Look at this. Surrounded by mountains. It's huge, this lock's bigger than I thought. It's a mile, it's a mile from there to here. Right, I'm just gonna find a pitch. Looks like she's found somewhere. After all that wind and bad weather, this is the reward. We've even got both doors open. Look at that one. The palace. Look at that view. Little kayak here. Just off you go. So quiet. So peaceful. Got the river running up there. Leanne's the way up there for some water. Water gathering. Yep, we've picked a good spot. It's nice and flat. It's perfect. That's the backdrop. There you go, have that. Ah, it's so nice to not be clinging on to stuff and freezing cold hands. <laughs> Just so nice. <laughs> Right, very well. We can do some cooking al fresco out here, a little kitchen area. We've got some nice steaks to have. A couple of beers. And we're laughing. Here she comes. Laughing, I tell you. I'll find out the name of these hills. Mountains, really. Here we go then. Look at the camp kitchen setup. In here we've got, oh, I just knocked my beer over. That was, I moaned it, but sorry. We've got some steaks, Denver, Denver steaks. Couldn't get sirloin, there was none left. Well, there was two, but they were crap. It was all fat. Uh, mushrooms with some garlic butter in. And a pot of perfect mash. I've got a pot to cook on in. Got my stove here, ready to accept the steaks. Everything's here, look who's back. Good game, good game. I am juice Forsyth. So we're gonna get a beer opened and we're gonna celebrate this night because this is absolutely perfect. This is the camp you dream of. After all them horrendous nights <laughs> surviving 
and we finally got a nice night. Leon's got a stash in the, the water there. I might put mine in the water because it's a good idea. Right, I'm gonna get on with this, bring you back when it's getting on. Coming along nicely, getting the steaks, sealing it, and then I'll let it just cook gently in the pan with a bit of butter in. Coming on nice. Tell you what else is coming on nice. Oh, Brucey's gone doing well. Look at that sky up there. Yes. Just letting it brown off a bit and get the mushrooms in. Where's the mushrooms? Are they there? Eh? Uh, How many mushrooms you've got? Loads. All of them. All the mushrooms. They go, they go like re register, don't they? And peppercorn and brandy sauce. With mashed potato, that's the best bit. Which it is. Champion. There we go. The finished article. Steaks here. Mash. Kind of beef. Nice. By a Scottish lock in a lovely still night. As you can see, it's dark now. So we're going to get this and then we're going to just continue with our little soiree. Clear all this up like what a mess we've got here. Look at this. It's like student accommodation again. <laughs> Wait, I want to get this before it gets cold. So here we are, having the time of our lives, beer on, cider, having a good time. Mm -hmm. How good a time is this? Mint. On a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being blend catheter. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> where, does it, where does this one come? <laughs> um, this is like 20. Oh, 20, 20. Yep, so it's mint, so we're just chilling out now. We've got the disco light. We might put that on later. But um, I did get a, a copyright warning the other day, so it's a bit tricky. Not a strike, but just a, I can't monetize the video. The people who the copyright belongs to can get the revenue off the video, which, uh, you know, it's an out. Doesn't matter. We're well, having a good time throwing stones in water. And drinking beer. So that's it. Drinking vodka. I mean, how we? We brings that. Right, that'll do. Just look how we're lying. Just lying like this by the lock. It's March the 20... What was it? 20... 26th, isn't it? 26th of March. <laughs> Look at it. I'm going in the water, mate. You're not like... Yeah, I am. Ready? Like... Here I go up. I'll do it off camera, though. Ready? <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. Oh, oh it's cold. Oh, it's freezing. It's freezing cold. Oh. All right, I'm out, I'm out. Did you go in all your clothes like? I did, I did go in all my clothes. Yeah, looks like it. And it's so cold that I come out dry. <laughs> all right. Really good, huh? All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, oh, here we are. 
We're uh, just chilling out by the loch. <laughs> oh. oh, so here we are. Hey! Oosh, 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 ah, ah, ah. Oh, no, yeah, we're, we're too chilled out to be um, mad disco of the night, like. Absolutely amazing, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Gorgeous. On a scale of 9,000 to 8 million, <laughs> <laughs> what is the... What is the chilled outness in this? Uh, 10 million. 10 million? Mm -hmm. It's canny that way. Not bad. Not bad. Unreal. We've got loads of stars above our heads, so we're gonna. I'll put the um, camera out and do a night lapse, see if that works. But we've got double disco light. Double disco light! <laughs> we've got double disco light, it's unreal. Music on. We've had all our beer. We've only had about uh, two cans each. Leon's drank all the vodka. That's it. So what, what's your brother's name? John? John. If you're listening or watching, Beef. what you got to say to John? Get your bum out with John. E. And Michelle. <laughs> and then... And then, snout. We yeah. just need to come out with one and have a good time. You won't have a good time, you'll be bored. You will bored. not be bored. You'll be bored stiff. <laughs> They'll have a good laugh. No. They will. All I'll do, right, is talk about myself all night. But you always do that anyway. I know. I know. But I mean, I am the star, after all. I know, I've got used to that fact by now, like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a fucking Klingon here. Ah. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> benches. Well, you Klingon. swore, you swore, swore in I my swore. video. I'm oh, not having that leg. Nah. I'm so sorry. That's I a swore. strike. That's one strike. <laughs> one strike. Okay. You're three strikes and you're out. Right. I'm just the Klingon. Sorry. I think I actually swore when I replied to you. <laughs> but that's not the point. It's my video. I can do what I want. No, you cannot. Yes, I can. Back on sweat. Yes, I can. Yes, I can do what I want. Whatever. Yeah. I can do what I want. Ah, see, I didn't have the light on again, man. Everything's, it shouldn't be so dim. Everything's in the dark. Right, so there's a tent over there. Boosh. Let's get it. Oh. Right, so I've got both doors open, right? This is a little bit of um it's a little bit of actual camping advice. I've got both doors open on the tent there, so venting completely. And it's still getting condensation on it. So all of you naysayers, right? It's the weather. It's not the tent. It's not the tent. It's the weather. Right? We couldn't have any more ventilation in that tent if we tried. And because because it was so like warm today, and now the temperature has massively dropped. There's condensation everywhere, and it's all to do with the weather it's not the tent will you please understand it's not the tent you know when you say oh my tent hasn't got condensation on yeah because the conditions weren't if if i had my tent beside your tent with no condensation no tent would have no condensation on but it's the weather the temperature was like 16 17 degrees when we came up here it's about two degrees now and it's dropped, so that's why you get the condensation. You're exaggerating, aren't you? It's about minus one. Honestly, I'm absolutely sick of people saying, oh, hilly bird tents, they get full of condensation, all the rest of it. It's not, it's every tent. <clears throat> anyway, I'm sorry. I'm gonna lose subscribers over that, but I don't care, I don't care. I'm putting my point across that it's the, it's the conditions of the weather. We've paid, we've paid for the lovely weather today by having a cold condensation tent tonight. And I mean, you, you couldn't get any more ventilator than having two doors open, could you? <laughs> right? Really so, know. if you've got anything to say about that, right, come and say it. <laughs> I'll talk to you about it. I'll knock you out, I'll knock you out. <laughs> ah, I've lost the plot, I've lost the plot. Right, going to turn off, boosh. <laughs> Thank you.
morning campers. Hi, hi, now zero zip, zilch, zero, nothing, not a thing, zip, zilch, not even tampo. Tampo's not even here. Oh, my back. My back's up. I've woke up. Did you remember to put your clocks forward? Did you? Did you? Wait a minute. Zip's miles away. Oh my goodness me, what a beautiful day. Look at this. Ah, oh, unreal. Unreal. We ran about condensation last night. It's actually more or less bone dry now. Sun's dried it all off. Oh. We're going to get the kettle on. And then we're gonna we're gonna have to pack away, which is gonna be tragic. But we're gonna have to do it. I thought you up there, give us a wave. Alright. So this is the surroundings we've woke up. Slept great. Slept the sleep of the dead. Alright. Get a cup of tea, nice cup of tea. So here we are. We've got all the stuff packed in my bags. We're just going to drop the tent now. How did that rank on your list of top ten camps? Probably nine. Nine? No, ten. It was a ten. It was really good. Ten's the lowest. One's number one. Oh well, one then. It was one. <laughs> She's not, she's not coming anymore. I'm hungover, I'm forced to drink vodka. Don't be saying that. Don't be giving secrets away. <laughs> Don't be giving secrets away, Harry. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to drop this tent, right? So I'm going to set this camera down here and watch how we set this tent away. Oh, I've gone in the moss, it's really wet. So there we go, tent is away. And Leanne's found herself a pal. Pick it up. She's got herself a wee arrow gog. Imagine it bites you. It's only a spider. You're out. Ooh, you're out. So, anybody coming here? There's your pitch there. There's some pitches over the back of the grassy bit there. There's about, there's room for about six tents there, isn't there? There's a pitch over there. You probably get some tents here as well. All in all, a good spot. We'll come back with my towels and that, and we'll get in. We've missed the trick there, like. I would have been in there if I'd had a big towel. Definitely. It's warm enough, isn't it? Well, it is when you, but when you come out, you start getting cold. So we're gonna just pack this lot away and then we're off. Right. Well, it's a sad time now. We've got to leave. So we've left the place immaculate as we found it. It was lovely when we found it. No spoiled. No, no spoilers. Right, we're all packed. Poles on. We're going to make our way back along there. It's a mile back to the top of the waterfall and then it's about another mile down. More tea, Vicar? <laughs> Anything to say? <laughs> right. I can edit that bit out. <laughs> you, yeah, you will. <laughs> right. Anyway, we'll have to leave this lovely place. So we had a lovely tea, lovely steak, loads of booze, perfect conditions. It was actually the perfect comp. Wasn't it? Next week we'll be like getting battered again, probably. But that was worth it. It was all worth it. All that struggling and bad weather was really worth it for that. Right, we'll see what happens on the way down.
so there we go the grey mare's tail actually built three waterfalls there's another big one behind it so if you come here for a walk go up there you go down there to the viewpoint but there's a barrier you know some people ignore the barrier and just go around there's like a path and go right up to it so we're thinking this was like pretty perfect wasn't it this camp very perfect i have no negatives about the camp well there is a negative and that is because the negative was we had to pack up and go home but other than that spot on chef's kiss right we'll see you on the next one